Hi everyone and welcome. In this video we will see how you can secure your node read flow. So apart from the register user, no one can modify your node read flow. Okay, so that thing we are going to see in this video. So here is my node read flow. If I put some, you know, inject or debug node here and uh, if I deploy it here, so anyone can log into my node read. Okay, anyone can open my node read using the command prompt and anyone can open this 127.0.0.1 and colon 1880 page and anyone can see this flow but i don't want it i want to secure this flow so only a register user can use this flow or it can modify the flow okay so that thing we can do by modifying the setting.js file okay so whenever you have installed your node read once settings.js file is created okay you have to modify this file to create a user and to give the permission to the user okay so if you open this settings.js file and if you scroll down here then you will see this admin auth okay so you can uh, read the note here to password protect the node red editor and the admin api so to protect your node red flow we can use this function admin auth function okay i have created a block for you so this is the default view okay so whenever you open your settings.js file these lines are commented okay you have to uncomment this line and then this is the username and you have to create a password but right now we don't have any password so how to create the hash password okay so for that you have to use this node red admin hash password command okay so you have to copy this command okay you have to open command prompt you have to paste it here and then you have to enter and here you have to enter your password okay suppose uh here is my admin account okay the username is admin and the password i want to set for admin is a password so p a double -S, s w o r d password okay i have type it here and then i'll hit enter so it will generate a hash for my password okay so i have to copy this i have to copy this and then i have to paste it here okay and then i have to save it so it got saved and the permission is everything so here we have a star so star means every permission okay so once you save it once you close it and then you have to navigate to this uh, command prompt you have to you know restart your node red so once your node red gets restart it will ask for you a password okay so see it will ask for you the password to edit the node red flow so if i refresh it then always it will ask me for a password if i provide the admin and also if i provide the password as an admin then it will ask login fail because i have provided the wrong password if i provide the actual password like p a w s w o r d then it will let me log in into the flow and it will let me edit the flow okay i can edit it and i can deploy it okay now if you want to log off then you can log off from here or you can log out from here now i want to create another user okay that also we can do so we have to again open the settings.js file here and then we have to again navigate to this admin auth we have to copy this okay and then we have to paste it here and my second username is root and the password i have to create a hash password for my second user okay so let me create the hash password from the command prompt so i have to run the same command like node red admin hash password and here i have to provide the password like t double o r okay so it will create a hash for me so i will copy this hash i will come here and and i'll paste it here and for my you know admin user i will only provide the read access and for my root user i am providing every access okay so i'm going to save it i'm going to close it okay and then i will restart my node red flow so control c node red okay okay it will ask me for username and password now we already know that we have a two users okay if i open my settings.js file then we have specified the two user the first user is admin and the second user is root okay 
admin user has only permission for read and the root user has permission for everything so if i open my notepad here and if i provide the username admin and the password is password okay it will say you must be logged in to access setting okay so the, uh, you have to ignore this warning but if you uh, change anything suppose if i want to add one more inject row here and if i want to add it okay if i want to create a flow like it and if i want to deploy it then i will not able to deploy you must be logged in to deploy the changes i am already logged in but as an admin user i am not logged in as a root user okay so as per our settings.js the admin user has only read access it cannot change any flow okay so that is why we are not able to deploy this flow if i log out from here leave the page and if i log in as a root user okay and then if i you know enter one more inject node and if i want to deploy then i'm able to deploy because i am logging as a root user okay so this is how this uh, access will work you have to add your user in the admin auth section like the first user is admin the second user is root you have to create a hash password for your uh, you know username and that you can do it by this command node rate admin hash password okay whatever password you want to set for your user you have to type it here and then it will generate the hash for you and then you have to paste the hash in the password section and then you have to specify the permission that which user has which permission okay i have specified everything in this blog that you can generate your password using this node red admin hash password command okay you have to update the setting.js so in the password section you have to provide the hash password and you have to save this file okay and i have provided the provided the original settings.js file in which you will see like this and uh, here i have done like this okay i have admin username and the uh, permission is read and the root username has a permission to everything okay so this is what i have done right now and it is working fine so if i log out from it and if i log in as an admin and password it will let me log in but i am not able to edit anything okay so this is that is the use of the you know permission and i have two user admin and root so i can log out from admin and i can again log into as a root user which has access to everything and which has every permission available in the node rate okay so this is how you can secure your node rate flow so a person can read the flow but it cannot edit okay and if you don't want to give them access then you can just you know uh, create the username and the user password is only available for you so no other person can access your node rate flow and uh, you can only uh, change the flow if you add you know some uh, ui nodes here like suppose if you add some text node here and if you configure it uh, let me configure it first okay if you configure it and if you deploy it and if you launch your dashboard okay and if you log out then no other user can modify your flow without your username and password they can only monitor the dashboard okay there is no other option to modify the flow to edit the flow to change anything into the flow they can only view the dashboard okay and the flow will work uh, in the background so this is how you can secure your node rate flow okay now in the next video we will also cover that how to secure your node red dashboard okay so whenever you launch your node red dashboard it will ask for username and password so this is how you can also secure your node red flow as well as you can secure your node red dashboard for any illegal access okay so i hope this thing is clear and you will get the you know mm, uh, all the detail in my blog you can see i will provide the blog link in the description of this video so you can use this uh, command to create a hash password you can update the settings.js file uh, okay whenever your node is installed you will find that file and the default you will look like this okay and you can uncomment these things you can put your hash password here and you can save it and then it will start working okay and then it will ask you for password whenever you launch your node red
okay but it will not ask you for password whenever whenever you launch your dashboard so dashboard password setting is the different thing okay so this is just for the uh node red flow uh security or node red edit security so i hope this thing is clear and if you want to download the original settings.js file then you can download this text file and then you can copy paste the content and if you want to download the modified file then you can uh, download from here as well as you can copy the content from here okay so i hope this thing is clear that how to secure your node red flow and if you still have any question or any doubt then you can ping me on whatsapp telegram instagram anywhere and i'll be happy to answer your question so we will meet you in the next video and in the next video we will see how to secure your node red dashboard okay so stay tuned for the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you